everybody welcome back to let's go geo so i'm just relaxing at camp and it is time for featured friday so this is what i have for us today as you see i have this kind of roundish looking rock here yes it is a rock and you might even be thinking kind of an ugly rock some people might think is this kind of an ugly rock um some people might also think "Ooh, that's interesting for one reason or another so Featured Fridays are where I show you a rock. So if you're a noob, I show you a specimen, and then I give you a challenge. Normally it's to guess what it is today. I might mix it up a little bit, uh, but this is our specimen for today. So the challenge is, guys, if you found this out in the field, if you were looking and you saw this kind of roundish rock, what would you think it is? Okay, so your challenge actually is, I'm gonna flip it over here soon. And I want you to guess, because we have it split open, I want you to take a guess. Do you think, what do you think it looks like on the inside? Do you think there's crystals on the inside? So some of you that have experience might have gone geode hunting. And if you did, uh, there were certain types of, of looking rocks that you were, you were targeting. Um, and so this might be one that you might pick up but there's no guarantee with geodes so we you know just because you see a suspect rock does not guarantee that there's crystals inside and a lot of times you break them open and you're kind of disappointed with what's inside either no crystals or kind of crappy crystals so guess for this one guess crystals or no crystals not just like one little let's say lined with crystals like a good geode crystals or nil no crystals at all so that's your that's your challenge for the comments this time. Drop your guess in the comments. Don't cheat. I will reveal it. I will turn it over here in a second and you can see uh, what it looks like on the inside. But guess, what do you think? If you found this, what would be your fun guess in the field? What do you think it looks like on the inside? Crystals or no crystals? So here's the outside of this thing for fun. Let me actually set it down um, and zoom into the surface. Let's take a look at the surface there. So there's the surface of this thing. So what we see here is volcanic related rock. So this is a rhyolitic volcanic rock and it's got some kind of desert concrete, we'll call that on the outside. Um, that's pretty common. And so it's kind of this um, mauve, kind of pinkish brownish colored volcanic rock. And like I said, it is definitely, this is commonly a rhyolitic uh, silica rich type of rock. And some things that I noticed here, this part got dinged up so you can kind of see the rock a little better without that coating on it. So there's the type of rock we're dealing with here. There hopefully you can see sort of that smooth volcanic rock. And then over here we have another little ding. And this one's interesting because what we see there is what looks like some other types of uh, minerals going on there. Um, so based on that, you know, if you saw this, would that make you think, so like I said, crystals or no crystals, not this. Okay. So if it's just this on the inside, no, wrong. So crystals as in actual formed crystals, not just like a gel like this, not like a silica gel, formed crystals, maybe a druzy coating, a lining on the inside. What do you think? Crystals, or no crystals. Um, yeah, so I had a friend slice this open so we can actually see a pretty good view. So, okay, let's do it. Let's flip it open and see what we have on the inside. Make sure your guess is in the comments because I'm about to flip it. Okay, five, four, three, two, one. Woo, and that's what we have on the inside. So if you guessed, if you guessed crystals, you were right. Uh, like I said, you, there's really no guarantee per se. There are things you can look for in the field. You don't always guarantee. Um, when you're in the field, you can take a kind of, you know, you can look for this. You can look for kind of a rounded rock. You know, imagine the other half's on there. It's kind of a rounded nodule here. Um, but as you can see, it's not like a smooth surface. So it's kind of bumpy texture, something like that. This was actually not a bad hint right there. I didn't want to say too many hints, but, you know, this told us that maybe there was some... Uh, minerals on the inside there's this, this silica gel but it didn't guarantee because you know could have just been like filled with that but yeah that told us 
uh, that something was going on and all we need is that void and then it lines the inside. Let me get some better views of it here, if I can. Uh, I'll zoom in on the inside there so you can see that baby is fully lined with crystals. How beautiful is that? Ooh, ah, nice geode we have here today. And then you can really see that rock surface there. That's even beautiful. It's in itself that we can see. Okay, so there we go. So, yeah, we'll eventually maybe go on some geode hunts here. Um, there are lots of things that fall roughly in the category of geode or, you know, essentially voids that might have crystals in them. So we'll talk more about that and maybe I'll do some of those. Uh, but for today, I just thought I would show you this. I was excited to see how it came out. It's actually quite a pretty piece. And as you can see, hopefully it's uh, a little hard to tell, but... Trying to get some good lighting on it. <clears throat> it is completely covered in crystals on the inside, coated with sort of some druzy lining there and some larger crystals there all over the inside. So pretty cool piece here. So that's your uh, featured Friday is this geode. And next Friday we will have another featured Friday. So stay tuned for that. If you want to check them all out, I stuck them in a playlist so you can see the Featured Friday playlist and go through them all, take some guesses. Otherwise, I'll see you guys here on the next adventure at Let's Go Geo.